Now we're going to see the troubleshooting for single orifice float trap. There are two parts to troubleshoot a single orifice float trap. One is steam leaking continuously and the second not discharging at all. The first part steam leaking continuously. One has to check the trap installation. Ensure that the trap is installed in a horizontal plane and the flow direction on the body is being followed. Once the installation is checked, one has to check the SLR setting. Ensure that the SLR is cracked open. That is, one eighth of a turn. Once the SLR setting is done and checked, open the trap to check for any kind of foreign particle deposition between the valve and seat. Check the valve and seat for any kind of deposition. If so, clean the same with cotton cloth. Once this is checked, reassemble the trap. Also check for any fine scratches on the wall and seat. If so, replace the main valve assembly. Refer the user manual for the procedure. The second part is not discharging at all. One has to again check the trap installation as shown. Check the process parameters, the actual differential pressure. Also check if any kind of additional back pressure is acting on the trap downstream. Check for the strainer blockage which is installed before the trap. And the last thing one has to check is whether the float is punctured. If so, replace the float. Ensure while assembling the float that the float should rest on the seat. This is how one troubleshoots a single orifice float trap.